What's going on, everybody? I hope you're enjoying your hump day Wednesday so far. This is MYG Jeffy T85 here, and I'm bringing you the black and blue injury report for the New York Giants. December 21st, I'm going to slip there, December 21st, 2022, as the New York Giants get ready for their Week 16 matchup down in Minneapolis, Minnesota, against the Minnesota Vikings in what should be a very high-powered game. Now, obviously, when we get to the black and blue injury report, it's actually a lot less players on the injury report than you think, but there's still some key players listed, and there's some key players that did not practice, will not practice, and were limited at practice today. <clears throat> obviously, yesterday, there was a walkthrough practice for the New York Giants. It wasn't official, but if you just go by what, the, what was said during the practice, there are some guys, key players, that did not practice at all yesterday, and it's the same thing for today. So the walkthrough yesterday is exactly what we had today. Obviously, we got the news yesterday during Brian Dayball's press conference. Xavier McKinney is not expected to practice this week. He will be out. He will not play. So the Giants will be without their starting safety in the back of the uh, secondary. He will not play. Maybe you could get him back during the game against the Colts in Week 17, or maybe they hold him out for that last game of the season. Depends on how... Xavier McKinney continues to rehab from that broken hand. And in terms of the injury report today, the same two people that have pretty much been out for the past few weeks did not practice again as a Dory Jackson who's dealing with that sprained MCL that he suffered against the Detroit Lions. He still did not practice today. <laughs> as well as Shane Lemieux who's been dealing with that hurt toe that he injured all the way back in preseason and training camp. Those two guys did not practice today. Not a good sign, especially with the fact we're going to need the final injury report tomorrow because the fact the Giants are going to be playing on Saturday and not on Sunday. So those two guys did not practice today, and I would be shocked at this point if either one of them plays. I don't count on Shane Lemieux. To me, he's just there. Even if he plays, he's probably not going to be out there much, maybe in jumbo packages. Shane Lemieux is not playing. He's hurt. Adore Jackson, I don't think he's going to play this week. Maybe you can get him back next week. But those two guys are, did not practice today. In terms of the limited players, Leonard Williams dealing with the neck injury. He was limited today at practice. But at least he was able to get a limited practice session. And so that's a positive sign that he's at least going to be able to go. Nick Vanette, the backup tight end for the New York Giants. He's got a shoulder injury. He had a limited practice today. But that's a positive sign, at least Nick Vanette is at least going to be able to go because we do need at least some tight end depth out there for this team. <laughs> Kayvon Thibodeau coming off that unbelievable game that he had this past Sunday night football against the Washington Commanders. He's dealing with an elbow injury. He was limited today at practice, but at least he was able to get some snaps in. Not worried about him. And Giants offensive tackle Evan Neal, he's dealing with a shoulder injury right now. Neal's been battling a whole lot of injuries. Thibodeau's been battling a lot of injuries. Uh, Leonard Williams has been battling a whole lot of injuries, but at least Evan Neal was able to get a limited practice today with that shoulder injury, which is a positive sign for the Giants that both their first-round picks, Thibodeau, fifth overall pick out of Oregon this year, and Evan Neal, the seventh overall pick out of Alabama, both those players at least got limited practice sessions today. Adore Jackson, Shane Lemieux did not practice, not expecting him to see them on Saturday against the Vikings, but I believe that Neal, Thibodeau, Vanette, and Williams are all just limited right now, but I'm not going to be surprised if any one of these guys play. I think they're just managing their snaps right now. I expect all four of those guys to be out there on the field Saturday afternoon against the Minnesota Vikings in what is going to be a very, very exciting and interesting game for the New York Giants heading into Week 16. <coughs> so that is your black and blue injury report. I know it's a short one, but not a whole lot of injuries over here. For the New York Giants, two players that did not practice this week, have not practiced in weeks. Adore Jackson with the sprain MCL, Shane Lemieux with the toe injury. They did not practice, not expecting them to play this Sunday or Saturday. I keep saying Sunday, it feels like Sunday. This Saturday, they will, be not be they will not be practicing. Don't expect them to play. Evan Neal with the shoulder injury, Kayvon Thibodeau with the elbow, Nick Vanette with a shoulder as well, and Leonard Williams with a neck injury. They got a limited session today. Have to wait and see how they look tomorrow at practice. But they all, at least getting limited sessions, makes me believe that they all will be ready for Saturday afternoon's game against the Minnesota Vikings down there in Minneapolis, Minnesota. So that is the black and blue injury report for the New York Giants 
on hump day Wednesday, December 21st, 2022, as the Giants continue to get prepared for the Saturday afternoon Christmas Eve matchup against the Minnesota Vikings. So if you like this video, hit the like button below. Sub up if you haven't already to NYGJPT85 for more breaking news, updates, chatter, and black and blue injury reports surrounding the New York Giants. Turn on the bell for notifications on the next video or short that's going to be dropping on the channel surrounding the New York Giants. And let me know in the comments section what you guys think about the injury report for the New York Giants today, leading into tomorrow, and obviously leading into the game this Saturday afternoon against the Vikings. Thank you very much, everybody. Enjoy your hump day Wednesday. Take it easy, and let's go New York football Giants. As always, together blue, everyone.